so where I'm at the moment is a really exciting stage in my life. I've just um, relaunched a blog about two weeks ago, which is going to be my main focus. I just want precision focus on that. Um, I've always had three or four businesses running, um, so I've just sold out of one and, and stopped the other. Um, so this is it. I'm just focusing straight on the blog. Um, you know, financially things are fine, um, but for me, you know, that things could start being definitely more abundant. I mean, I'm working from 5 a.m. in the morning and then till 7 and then the kids go to school and then I work all day and then pick them up again and then and work a bit at night. So for the hours that I'm putting in, I could definitely be more abundant. <laughs> think with me I like to feel like I'm in my flow I like to feel like I'm working for a purpose um, and what the unstoppable program has sort of retrained me to, to is to be out of um, lack and into a space where I can create again so I'm loving that transition um, but now it's just about expanding my mind to the next level to be like this is possible you know as a single mum with three kids this is still really possible you can do all this you can do it on your own you don't need you know to rely on anyone no one else needs to dictate your life you are in control and you can create absolutely the life that you want and I think that's my next step is just um, really getting that belief system happening you know subconsciously and and without thinking about it and just with a knowing yeah, that's what I'd like to see. <laughs> so I've just finished my second session of the Abundance Money Program um, and I feel good. I mean, I've literally just walked out of my second session so I always feel very open and light and like I've just had a gorgeous little afternoon nap. I'm not feeling a lot mentally different just yet um, but I think as per the last time, I took a little while for it to kick in. So um, yeah, we'll see. It was really good. Um, so I've just finished my fourth session, um, just come out of my fourth session and I'm feeling really clear. Um, it kind of takes everything out of your mind so you can sort of start getting on with the day and I'm slowly getting um, improvements. I'm feeling like I'm dealing with things, especially money issues, better than what I would have with less emotion really and more clarity. Money was debited from my account for two loads of swimming lessons and usually um, that would put me in a panic because I need everything to know exactly what's going on. Um, but yeah, I think I just, it came out and I just kind of, I don't know, you just don't go into an emotional spin. You sort of go into it, okay, that's happened, let's move on. And I think that was just, yeah, one example of the week, which was good. I think it's just karma. I think you just don't go into a panic um, and you don't really notice it's happening after until you think, oh, what happened this week? And you think, oh, I dealt with that differently and, and that happened and I felt different about it. So, yeah, I think it's, it's a slow sort of improvement, a slow burn. Um, but, yeah, I would have panicked before just because, you know, people taking things out and then, you know, not knowing where everything else is coming from. But, yeah. um, no, it was definitely a non-panicking moment. Yeah, it works good. Work's definitely coming in more consistently and I'm feeling like there's more space to be creative now, whereas before I was very reactive to things that were going on and people had approached me and I'd just say yes or no. But over the past couple of weeks, I'm really starting to put things in place which I can target where I want to go and what I want to be doing. And um, I've never felt like I've had a lot of space for that. It's not of extra energy, so yeah, that's a positive, definite positive. So we moved house uh, three weeks ago today, um, which was great. It hasn't been really, you know, stressful at all. I think it's been a really good move. Um, you know, I've never really worried too much about moving house, but a lot of things changed here. We have, you know, our partners moved in, um, so that's been a big change with the kids. Um, but other than that, no, the move's been really good. We're really happy, and I mean. Look, this is just brilliant looking at this every day. I can't say too much about some business projects I have coming up, but I've just signed on to be an ambassador for the City to Surf, um, which is huge. So that's not only um, charity, but fitness, children, um, children with disabilities. Um, so that's really, really exciting to be asked to be involved in that. Um, the website, Rainella, is just, we doubled our traffic in the last month. Um, so we're just uh, hoping to keep that going. Um, and I had a pretty big business idea that I can't talk about just yet um, because if this comes off, it'll be about six months in the making. But, you know, mark this in six months. I'm sure you know exactly what it will all be about. Um, the finance situation with the move is probably just exactly the same. Um, so 
it's neither here nor there. Um, but yeah, look, I, I think the, also the biggest thing with me is I'm not so much focused on finance and money anymore. I'm really focused on just living day to day and getting things done and the move and the business and just I just have this like knowing that everything else is coming and is just taking care of itself, which is a really nice place to be where the, you know, I know where the finances are at, but it's not just that main focal point of far out what's going on, you know, it's just a real, it's, it's a, I feel like it's in a flow. I definitely think that fear around um, what's coming up, what have I got coming up, oh my God, is there going to be enough, am I going to be able to do this, am I going to be able to, you know, school holidays, am I going to have enough to be able to take the kids on a holiday, I definitely feel like that's um, subsided. Um, and it's just more around, you know, we'll be fine. We'll be fine, we've got this far, we'll be fine. Anything more than what we've got is always gonna be a bonus. Um, but yeah, being very content with where we're at and not always in fearful of that, you know, that you're not gonna have enough, um, yeah, is definitely a mindset that sort of slightly changed, definitely. I've loved the program. Um, and I just had a chat with Cherry about some other options that they have. They've got like motherhood stress and they've got some stuff for kids and I'm excited about trying these and intro introducing my family um, to different ways of thinking and um, yeah, what the Brain Wellness Bar has to offer. It's really exciting. I'm, I'm loving it. I'll definitely be coming in every couple of months um, for a top up, um, for a little maintenance program. But you know, I listen to the um, cassettes, uh, the, the audio, I listen to the audio at night, so I know I'm getting enough through those. Um, but yeah, no, definitely, I, I think it's part of my life. And, you know, I, I believe in all that stuff, the brain, you know, we have control over it, but there's so much that we don't have control over and that we don't know. And if there's something that can get in there and reset, um, you know, neuro paths and, and change the way that we think and view the world, it's just, you know, it's a gift. Yeah, so yeah, I, I definitely love the Brain Wellness Bar.